the words of wisdom from Drew Solomon. Thank you, Aaron. That was uh, quite nice. Um, I am bound and determined to do this in 90 seconds. I promise, after watching Aaron probably talk longer than I've ever seen him speak in his life, um, I am bound and determined, like I said, to do this in 90 seconds. So, uh, as Aaron mentioned, I am Drew Solomon, Economic Development Corporation. Very blessed and fortunate to be a member of the Board of Directors for Kansas City Digital Drive. Spectacular organization. Want to talk to you this evening about three quick things uh, as it pertains to what we've done uh, as an organization and, and a little bit of a testament to Aaron's leadership on some of these fronts. Number one, economic development takes a huge swath of, of different definitions and meanings for a lot of folks. For me, it means advancing prosperity and creating quality jobs for all folks in our community. And that's a really through technology and the growth of new, new business formation and firms, a lot of that's possible. And so with that, it's been really interesting. Everybody talks about, you know, kind of the, the going concerns of Kansas City and all these things we've got going on. If you'll just take a quick second and think back three plus years ago, there was no Google Fiber, there was no Cisco Smart Cities, there was no Digital Sandbox, there was no Launch KC, there was no Digital Drive, there was no um, Living Lab, there was no Think Big Partners building. All this stuff in the last three years has moved the needle for Kansas City. And so to Aaron's point about thinking to the future, I can only imagine what the next three or four years are going to look like in Kansas City as a result of all the efforts of all the people doing great things in Kansas City right now and in our region around this. And one, one of the constant factors in all of this, um, whether it's the, the Launch KC Grant Competition or Tech Week or some of the other things that have been going on the Kansas City Startup Village, um, Aaron has been a quiet leader and Digital Drive has been a constant factor in a lot of the things we're doing. So I would implore you all this evening as you think about this, um, think about how we can continue to move this forward and, and really think about what the future looks like for Kansas City and, and know that Digital Drive, Jason and Aaron and a lot of other folks are thinking hard to help make that happen. Thank you so much for having me here. So Aaron introduced me as CEO of Planet Impact, but I'm also principal of Draw Architecture and Urban Design. And every day we're asked to solve real world problems about how we build our cities. So Planet Impact is a tool that allows us to use whoops, open data as well as 3D modeling and take advantage of gigabit technology in order to find ways to solve those kinds of problems and find ways for us to work better together to build our future cities. Um, so Draw does a wide variety of kinds of projects from um, high performance business interiors to uh, hospitality to public realm. And uh, we see our design teams and our uh, clients' frustration every day about how to solve issues about how to reduce energy usage, how to uh, do better with storm water. Am I still feeding back? Is it better? Okay. Um, and, and how to increase connectivity and um, improve the quality of our public spaces. So um, I just want to say Kansas City Digital Drive allowed us to create a disruptive technology. We would not be here without them. Um, we had an incredible opportunity to be part of one of the first Google hackathons that they sponsored. Um, and uh, the team that we built uh, is still um, very much engaged throughout the whole process. So we had folks like uh, Beth Dawson from Mark, we had um, Sarah Bear and Andrew Hyder from Code for America, who are all now part of our advisory board in order to help us um, build a business around this technology that looked at 3D visualization and real-time data processing. Um, and so we went on after that to be awarded $20,000 in grant funds from US Ignite, um, over $30,000 uh, as a gigabit community fund winner, um, and that allowed us to build out uh, our, our pilot uh, tool. Um, and so we just finished the, uh, the gig tank in Chattanooga. We were very excited about that, and we're really looking forward to the future of what the Kansas City community uh, is going to allow our business to do.